Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 20th. So remember, the timing is fluid, so this could resonate any time from now up until whenever, you know? We're all on different schedules. So we're just going to see what comes up for the 20th. We're going to get three of these like we did yesterday, and then we're going to use that deck right there. Again, these are from Ciro Marchetti, both of these decks. What do we got for the 20th? <laughs> Faith. This is the Hierophant. Believe in yourself. It's time to go your own way. Maybe you've been deepening your practice, your spiritual practice, becoming more self-aware. This is also the sign of Taurus. This is about listening to your inner guidance. It's like your inner guide is talking to you. This is a, this is a, a master, right, or a mentor. Have you been listening? Have you been listening? I mean, this is the high priestess's, I mean, counterpart, right? Are you listening? Have you been listening? Do you have faith in yourself? Do you believe in yourself? fortune. Destined, fated, change of course. Fate. Destiny is stepping in to bring you something better. So every Something or everything that is happening right now in your life or something that is happening right now in your life is happening for a purpose. There's a reason. At the end of this change, you're going to receive something good. This is the Wheel of Fortune. So at the end of it, there's something good. But you got to remember to have faith. Trust. Believe that there's a reason. You could call this a lucky break. You may not see it as a lucky break, but it is. It's a completion of one cycle of your life is over. I mean, the wheel is a cycle, right? So, a chapter. A chapter is coming to an end, and you are about to embark on a new chapter. One more card. Destined change of course. Believe that it's happening for a reason, please. This is Jesus awareness. Pretty similar energies, okay? A little bit different, but very similar. I mean, this is going within to become consciously aware. This one's listening to their inner guide, letting their inner guide lead them down the destined path. Right now, it's definitely a time of introspection and reflection. Somebody is becoming consciously aware, perhaps, of what is destiny. You know, what is meant to be. What is meant to be is meant to be. Maybe that's the awareness. Somebody has come to that painful awareness that, you know, whatever happened, it happened for a reason, and it's time for me to change this course, or, you know, there's something better coming. That's what the wheel is. Maybe somebody has has finally is finally realizing, right? I mean that could certainly be the case. We have Virgo, we have Taurus. And we have anybody. This is this reading is for anybody. I'm just letting you know. Um, a lot of times that Wheel of Fortune, you know, has 
what well, it does it has everybody on there if you look at the wheel that that takes care of everybody it does everybody is going through a faded change of course you are being called to have faith and trust that whatever is meant to be is meant to be that's what's going on here everybody's going within anyway that's what's that's what's up that is what's up Enlightenment. <laughs> absolute. Absolute enlightenment. This is like an awakening. It is. Somebody is going through an awakening. And this awakening is changing their life. It's changing their life path. of faith somebody has been lacking faith they haven't been trusting in the divine they haven't they haven't been putting in a lot of effort there's been a lack of wish fulfillment there's been a lack of reciprocation there's been a lack of balance right I mean the six of coins reversed things have been unharmonious uh, unbalanced uh, maybe Somebody's lost their faith. Faith and happiness. Faith and wish fulfillment. You always got to see if it's mirroring each other. We're going to put another card right. Hoo, 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 hoo. Wow. Okay. Wow. And that is crazy. Okay. So we definitely have earth energy here. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. So... Here we have Taurus again, but this it's reversed, okay? There's been lack of faith. You know, if you think about the devil, and I'm not saying that this is that all Capricorns are the devil, but the devil will try to steal your faith. <laughs> the devil will put everything in your in your path to to keep you asleep, to steal your faith, to steal your energy. To steal your wish fulfillment. To make things unbalanced. No joke. That's, that's like Satan at its finest. The devil doesn't really want you to be happy. They don't really want you to have wish fulfillment. They don't want you to believe. They don't want you to trust. They want to sabotage your happiness really. They want to steal it from you. They want to keep control. Now this is ego. This is something going on behind the scenes. Devil's ruled by shadow. I'm not saying that all Capricorns are. I'm reading the card right now. This is ruled by the shadow side. Ruled by the unseen. There's hidden forces here that have been, been keeping you down. They've been keeping you... unhappy but it looks real good and it feels real good but there's really no there's no commitment here there's no <coughs> receiving what you really deserve out of this you deserve wish fulfillment, but somebody's not receiving wish fulfillment. They've given up. They've lost faith. They've lost faith in happiness because of... Uh, ego, pride, hidden forces, addictions, obsessions...
something toxic. Somebody is holding on to a toxic situation for, I don't know why. We're going to have to get a bunch more cards. Ooh. Wow. Oh, my goodness gracious. Definitely an absence here. You guys saw me flip the cards the whole nine yards. There's definitely an absence here. Looks to me like we have somebody that is making a decision to let go, or they have. Somebody has made a decision to let go. Okay, the four of coins is let go. Let go of a toxic situation, let go of a lie. I mean, we could be dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We have the earth signs I've already mentioned. We have Aquarius. We have Pisces. We have everybody, so it doesn't really matter. Um, somebody has made a decision. This is this Two of Swords reverse. It's like they're ready to let go. They are. They're ready to let go. They're ready to open up. Somebody's been clinging to control. But I think we have this person that's just ready to just give up. It's just like giving up. I'm giving up. I don't have any desire to put any, any more work in. There's loss of concentration, loss of focus, loss of energy. We could have some, you know... There's, depth, there's been lack of awareness. There may have been some self-loathing. There could be some insecurities. We have somebody here that's been getting discouraged. It seems like they've, they're, being, they're discouraged because no matter what they do, they can't get what they want. You know, they can't get the reciprocation or they... they it's like they can't get anywhere. They've lost their faith. <laughs> you got to have faith. If you don't believe, it's like your thoughts become things. If you don't believe, then, you know, you're in trouble. You are. Then, then, the, then the devil is in control. You know, they've stolen your, your faith. They've stolen it. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. This is, this is letting yourself be caged it's letting yourself be stuck to a toxic situation that really doesn't serve you and it's kind of funny because it's the only upright card here and i shuffled while i was laying out the cards okay right now the devil is in control and that is very 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 clear Emperor reversed. There's chaos. There's chaos. There's chaos. There could be some anger. Resentment. Anxiety. Loss of direction. Loss of self. Somebody has gone through some sort of repression oh god it's the truth this is a rep seriously we got a repression here somebody somebody has gone through a repression they have they've gone for a repression through a repression a loss of self and they've given up on wish fulfillment they've get it, they've given up on getting what they deserve it's like we've had somebody here that's just given up
Six of Swords reverse. This is reluctant to take a new approach. We have somebody either here that has been reluctant to take a new approach because they, 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 they don't believe in themselves. They don't believe in a higher power. They don't believe in their intuition. They haven't been listening to their inner guide. We have somebody that's been letting their thoughts and their old ideas, their old ways, hinder them from balance and harmony. Both these sixes are reversed. Sixes are the journey to balance and harmony. They're both reversed. Somebody's just not taking it. They're not taking the steps that they need to take. It's like they're just not putting in any effort to make changes. And it's causing chaos. It's causing anger. It's causing disorder. When in fact it's really time for a change with that wheel of fortune that is destined fated change of course it's, it's it has to happen somebody could have been dealing with a person that had hidden agendas they could have been dealing with a person that was just after them for money or some kind of security and that's why they gave up it's like damn now there could be some anger, some regrets, whatever. Somebody's making a move, though. Knight of Wands, this is acting, taking action. So it's about to change. We have somebody here that is, is done thinking about it. I think they've reached that point where i got to take some action here. There's no wish fulfillment where I'm at. It's time. It's time for me to, to get moving. Judgment. Wake up. Well, the way we talked about this, wake up. I mean, this is waking up. They get this epiphany. It's time. It's time for me to take action. So we do have somebody that is waking up. Some sort of truth is about to be revealed. It's coming to an end. This lack of wish fulfillment. This lack of faith and trust. This inability to move on is coming to an end. We have somebody here that is taking action. It's like, you know what? I see. I see the light. I see. It's like, it's like God, okay, or your higher power. This is Jesus consciousness is, is waking you up. It's like giving you that epiphany that saying, you know what? It's time to go. It's time to take action. Act now. Think later. Stop stalling. Believe in me. Trust me. Listen to me. It's almost like I think somebody has heard the call. It's like they've gotten the message. I've got to go. Five of Wands. Conflict. Conflict. Bat tug of war back and forth. Ooh. <clears throat> this is conflict over starting over conflict over perhaps taking your power back waking up conflict over following your own truth perhaps there's many people involved there is there's many many people involved here in this situation And there's a lot of tension. There's been a lot of tension, okay? There has. There's been a lot of tension. There's been a lot of, I would almost say, it's like disagreements. But we definitely have somebody who's waking up. I mean, these are both wake-up calls. They may be waking up, you know, that, you know, there's this, this, that I've been taken advantage of. I've been acting naive. I've acted recklessly. And now I have to take my power back. We definitely have a wake-up call. 
You could be receiving a call. Just saying, somebody could be receiving a call. This is a judgment call and it's a wake up. We got a wake up call. Somebody could be receiving a call. That somebody is is giving up. It's like I. Mm, relocating. You got somebody here that's relocating, deciding to, you know, it's it's harvest time. Is I gotta take what I got and I gotta go. It's time to go. No more growth here. This season is over. It's there's 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 the truth being exposed. I'm telling you what, this, there is. There's some sort of truth being exposed or it has been exposed and somebody is deciding to go someplace else, to plant their seed someplace else. There could be some dashed expectations. There has been some dashed expectations. Somebody was hoping for the best and it didn't pan out. Somebody's wasted some time, right? It's, they have, and maybe they feel that way. You know, I've wasted time not seeing the opportunities because of an addiction, an obsession, or a toxic situation that has held me back from wish fulfillment. Anyway, somebody has wasted some time holding on to something that probably was a lie. Perhaps now the the ship has already sailed. I don't know. I don't know. Somebody's been thinking about walking away, and they've been thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it, but unable to take action. Right? They have, for some reason. But as they have been able to take action, there's been resentment and anger building up. They may have been treated unfairly and it's caused them to, you know, get more upset as time goes by. There's unfair treatment here. Somebody could be dealing with a person that is cold and heartless. Just saying, I am being honest with you here. And they see, they see. We could have somebody here that's just not being logical as well. Somebody that doesn't, not being logical at all. Not thinking clearly, confused. Somebody has been confused and I think now they're seeing the light. Maybe they've been abused by another person and they, you know, were scared. I mean, the devil will instill fear to keep you stuck. So somebody may have been too scared to move on. But it's like I think somebody has we has been has received that epiphany that you know it's time to take my power back and communicate my truth. So I feel like we have somebody here that has lost their faith definitely with the hero font reversed and the fool reversed. There's there's lack of faith. They lost their faith. They've given up. Or now they're giving up. It's like, I'm giving up. I'm giving up on this. I see the truth. And I'm taking action. So I feel like we do have somebody here that is deciding that, you know, I've waited long enough. I've waited long enough. This is all I'm going to get. I can't waste any more time. I got to take some action. I got to I gotta let go. It's time for me to own it. It's time for me to take back my power and accept the truth of whatever this is. So I feel like we do have, this is taking action. We have somebody that is taking fast action after there has been a delay. There has been a delay in, in wish fulfillment, in, you know, getting what you deserve. And it's like the time is now. The time is now. We have somebody here that has gained a lot of wisdom, okay, through introspection, like I said earlier or yesterday. 
You know, that we have somebody that's become con. This is Jesus awareness. It really is. We have somebody here that has woken up. They've delayed long enough. Somebody may be shutting down communication instantly. Bringing something to a complete halt. Could be with the Queen of Cups. This Queen of Cups is reversed. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I don't know. I think we have uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius reversed. Here we have everybody here. I've already named the other signs. Every Any sign. We have somebody here that may play a victim. We may have somebody here that has a victim mentality. I mean... And this person has used emotional blackmail as a tactic. This could be a very emotional time as well. This could be very emotional where you feel like you need to retreat. You need to go within to figure out your next step. You may decide you don't want to communicate with anybody because this is a difficult period in your life. This is difficult. You may feel like you've been treated unfairly. You may feel like you've been abused. You may feel like you've invested your time and energy in a toxic situation and now you got to heal and you need to do it alone. I feel as though somebody is wanting to go their own way and they're probably going to take action. Um... The truth is definitely being delivered with the judgment and the Ace of Swords. There's no doubt. The truth is coming out, okay? About unfair treatment or about an unjust partnership that just isn't reciprocal. You know what I mean? There's, there's no equal give and take here. There's no wish fulfillment, there's no happiness, and it's like, I gotta, I gotta go someplace else, I think somebody gets this realization, this revelation that it's time for me, the season is over, I accept, I mean, the judgment with, with, this is acceptance, it really is, I accept, I accept that there is no growth here, I accept that there's too much conflict, I accept that it's time for me to complete this cycle in my life. Somebody's been thinking long and hard, long and hard about starting over. And I think they're, they're getting or they have received the information that they need. I feel like it's a tense time. It's very tense, tense energy. Somebody is breaking free. This is personal freedom. Ten of Wands reverse is breaking free freeing yourself this is collapse this is this is the conscious change that brings balance back to your life it's when you drop that burden you drop that baggage you drop that weight you drop that load you drop it and, and you and you, balance comes back instantly Somebody is breaking free from an overwhelming situation that has turned their lives upside down. It's over. Somebody has accepted that they can't carry this anymore. They've reached the point of collapse. So I feel like today is a day of absolution, acceptance. Release and personal freedom. <laughs>